as I heard, as they said, my name is Paul Rousse Sabagina. Gusesa in Kinderwanda means to disperse. Abagina means enemies. So Ru is named he who disperses enemies. A warrior. Are you warriors tonight? <laughs> <laughs> well, tonight, um, uh, this is a miracle. To see myself, somebody who has been kidnapped and brought to hell, and it happens to see himself here tonight. It is a miracle. Because so far, no other one has ever been kidnapped. The way I have been kidnapped, taken to Rwanda, and happened to be, to get out alive the way today I'm here. Why I am here? I am here because there are many people on the earth who stood up and fought for my freedom. And tonight, I'm here to tell the Robert Kennedy Human Rights Organization it is always very hard to say thank you. And I believe thank you is not always enough. When I have better words, I will use those ones. Because what the Kennedy Foundation, the Kennedy Human Rights Organization performed for me was not a miracle, but miracles. They saved my life. I was sentenced for life, and today, surprisingly, I'm telling you that after somebody sentenced for life, after two years and seven months, I found myself out of hell. Kennedy Human Rights Organization, I cannot thank you enough because you performed the miracles. You saved my life. But when I was getting out of hell, a place I call hell, there were thousands of other prisoners. The Rwandan, the Rwandan dictatorship did not want to release me daytime for two reasons. One, they did not want the media to see me getting up and then happen to talk to me. And then I tell them, what had happened to me. That was one. Second, they did not want to see all the prisoners who have been in the same prison for two years and seven months, but without seeing me because I was in a kind of my small cell in a confinement. They didn't want them to see me out. But I'm free. They, they, free. they happen to set me free in the night. But still, when the prisoners, the prisoners had the heart, they time that I was going to be free that day. Then, when they, they waited for me to be free, at one in the afternoon, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then they were almost discouraged to see me getting up. But they saw that time at 8.30, they saw in the night, they saw that the director of the prison coming to my cell, to my confinement, where I was just lonely. I had been lonely for so long. And then, they, they were, they, when they saw the director of the prison coming to my cell, they, all of them, thought that I was going to be set free that night. And they just lined up, waited for the director who was coming to my, the, the assistant or the, the deputy director who was also coming with the director and many high ranking. Recording in progress. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then, I love it. And then, and then, when they saw them coming to my cell, they said, now he's going to be set free. And at 8.30, that is when I was 